Welcome to another Dreinschlag tutorial on historical European fencing with a longsword. Uh, this time sponsored by Black Armory, who provided us with this fencing jacket. Check out their website, you can find the link in the description uh, to this video. So, what's new in this video? We're going to introduce you to a low defensive guard called Flug, and we'll take a close look at, what, at an example of what you can do from this guard. Let's get to it. Now, as for the position itself, um, as you can see, Gregor has already moved into Pflug. Uh, the sword is held at your right side or your left side, in this case at his right side, at about hip level. The sword is facing towards your opponent, the tip is pointing between your opponent's eyes, thereby basically creating a wall of steel between yourself and your opponent. Uh, one point to watch out for here, if you move the Pflug to the left side, you change, you, uh, you rotate your sword so the false edge is facing forward. That's basically it. Let's move right back to uh, right fluke. Now let's see what happens when Gedi attacks with an Oberhaupt. What Gregor does now, he moves his blade up and forward in a sort of corkscrew motion, very similar to what we showed you in video number four, upsets him. Uh, as you can see, he intercepts Gedi's blade with the false edge ending up in an ideal thrusting position, like this, thus hopefully ending the fight. Thanks, let's have this once more in one motion please. <laughs> 